Hello everyone. I'm here today to talk to you about an interesting series of functions that was released by Google Sheets recently. So one of them is the lambda function, which is the basically the core of all new functions introduced by Google Sheets. Now these functions have been existing on Excel, but for the first time it's been introduced on Google Sheets and uh, I think it has been a revolutionary thing to be introducing uh, opening uh, Google Sheet users to a very wide range of functions and calculations that they can do now on Google Sheets. So in its own Lambda function is a very simple function to learn and you may think why are we even learning it. However, clubbing this Lambda function onto multiple other new functions that has been introduced can really change how you calculate. And uh, today we are just going to learn about these but if you want um, I can link some videos about the different combinations of lambda function which you can use. So in theory it's a very simple function. Let's go through the formula uh, but before that I will take you through the situation we will be uh, going through. Let's say we are a shop as usual and we have a series of products that we are ready to sell on delivery and uh, here is the ID, the product name, category and price and right now what we need to calculate is how much it, it costs if the packaging is a certain amount and there is a delivery cost per product that we are charging so that's like a very basic calculation i thought we should be doing and in general i thought maybe that would be the best way to explain how this formula works now talking a little more about uh, what we'll be doing today is trying to understand individually how much this price will turn out to be if we include a packaging by every product and how much will it be if it includes the delivery and packaging by every product. Now you could just do that right now with just adding this price with packaging and delivery cost but please stay with me just to explain the function it is important to focus on how to use lambda and once we have clearly understood lambda then we'll use it for more complex functions so i will go and explain to you how the lambda function works super simple first you have to write equal to lambda and then um, basically you have to define what you would like to call your function so in this case if you want to call this function or this value as x set this value as x and what you want to do with this value and then next to it just add the value itself so if i was to use it in practical form you can select equal to lambda say I want to give the name of this value as x and what do I want to do with this x is take x add the packaging costs and once I have done this I just need to mention what the actual value of x is and it will do the function now in order to understand lambda it is very important that independently when you use lambda after writing the whole formula you have to mention the actual value it is supposed to calculate for so if i just go ahead and do it and calculate it for everything it will suggest that the price after packaging would be this in another case if we have more values to it we could just do the same thing we just say lambda what is the name that I would like to give? You could give it any name. So you could just say total price, let's say, or let's say just product price. Okay, what I want to do is add take product price, add packaging and delivery cost to it and just mention what this product price is which is this there you go and we have all the calculations in one place so that's how easily you can do this lambda function there are many other functions which you can use uh, with lambda which have been recently 
introduced by Google Sheets. It's by call. Then we have by row. We have map function. We have reduce function and many more. So I will see you soon in many other videos and hopefully we will be able to do these calculations ourselves. Take care and see you. Bye.